What's up world, it's a brand new day. We're sitting here at Adam's house and we're currently trying to figure out a how-to to do for you guys. I'm thinking a uh, how-to switch bar. We're just gonna do it out front of the house. I don't know, what are you thinking? I don't care. I don't really care either. I kind of want, I, we care what you guys think, but I guess we can't, we can't really. get that. Yeah, we can't get that right now because we're but. trying something new right now, so. Um, Let's just do the switch bars. A hop switch bar? Hop switch bar. All right. I like fucking, I kind of suck at switch 180 bars. Oh, uh, let's try to see which up. We're gonna we'll, do the hop. We'll figure something out. I'll try to get something. All right, let's do this. It's gonna be like a weird how-to, but we're gonna do it. I gotta roll my shit. Hold up. Hold up. I gotta get my bike. <sighs> Respect. It's all about this. Respect that. Yes, Zia, all day. Oh shit. Yeah. First, you gotta get your bike. Yeah, you gotta get your bike. You gotta throw it outside. Gotta let her warm up, put her in the sun, so she's warm. Yep. Oh, then you get this thing. I wait. Oh. There you go. I hear your back cracking. Yeah, it hurts. This thing's too hard. Do a switch bar right away inside the house. You gonna do one in the house? Sure. All right. Make for a good thumbnail. And if I fall, it'll be funny. Let me get out the way. You should be okay. Oh yeah, it's a good day. It's a good day when you do a first try. In your house. There you go. No, we'll do it out front in the street. Right. Sorry guys, I wanted to do a vlog today, but my allergies are killing me. And I feel like shit, and I need to sleep, and I need to take medicine, and just relax for a couple days, because I haven't been sick. I haven't been sick in a minute, actually, to be honest, it's been six months since I started eating and taking care of myself way better, but uh, it's that time of year where I'm starting to feel sick, so uh, yeah, I gotta do that. So we're gonna do a how-to with Adam McCarty, the first time ever. First how-to on my channel. So I just like start telling them how to do it, or do I just do like a shitload of them and let them watch it? I mean, however you want to explain it. I just like squeeze my cranks at my seat. That's why I ride a ridiculous amount of seat post so that I can pinch it. My bike doesn't fall over, especially with switch bars because it like gets all wobbly. Yeah. But yeah, you just squeeze and like just pretend like it's a regular bar, and it usually works. All right, let's see. Do it right here in front of me. Well, you gotta like watch what you're doing. I kind of like straighten my knees, lean forward a little bit, and then you like get underneath it when you throw it so that your front end doesn't fall. Because if you just like throw it and lean back, your front end's just gonna fall out from under you. And so you gotta like pick up on it. And I kind of like, it's ugly, but my arms do like an X so that I can catch it right away. And it's like, I don't know. You just throw it and then like pull it the rest of the way around with your other hand. That's how I do it anyway. I can't like wait until it comes all the way around. What are you, your left foot forward or right foot? Right. Explain switch. Right foot forward. So regular is if you throw it into your foot. It just like, it works better. It's easier to do it that way. Show them a regular one. A regular one? All right. I'm gonna go the other way. All right. So you threw with your... You threw, if, your right foot forward, regular is with your right hand, or, I mean, it just really depends on what you learn first, but switch is technically away, like, away from your front foot. So if you throw it with your opposite hand, right foot forward, if I throw it with my left hand, that's a switch bar, and it's harder, it feels weird, and I don't land all of them. Sometimes, just depends. You gotta squeeze, remember squeeze. It helps. Pinch your seat or your cranks, whatever you got. What's the best way to learn it? Hopping out of quarter pipe? I did it out of a quarter pipe. I wish I had a quarter pipe in the middle of my street to ride to show it to you. But you just kind of, it just takes the hop out of it. Because when you do a bunny hop, you have to like hop and level out and then throw it. And you got to hop. I don't know. It just takes more effort. Out of a quarter, you just kind of float. And you can just spin them. If you want to take your feet off and bail, it's a little bit easier. You have more time. You can think about it. And yeah, just going higher makes it easier. Because you have more time to 
watch. So you recommend you recommend people doing it out of quarter pipes? That or a bank. Whatever whatever feels comfortable. I learned it out of a quarter. Some people do it out of banks. You can do it like on a wedge. You can do it go up a bank and do it to fakie if you want to do it like that. You can do whatever you want. I think the hardest is like 180 or like air on a bank. When you're spinning opposite and doing an opposite bar, it gets all floppy. Sorry, can't cuss on the YouTube channel. It gets all floppy and not good. <laughs> Let's do a, can you do a couple combinations with it? Like once you learn it? Yeah. I mean Yeah. Combos on flat. You can do switch 180 bar. Switch 180 bar on flat. If I do that first try today, today's gonna be a great day. Oh, hold up. Let me do a regular one first. I gotta do. That was the first time I got a rocket today. There you go. That was a regular one. Regular. Switch is gonna look gross and not good. Oh. Dude, I can't do it. Oh, you good? Yeah. See, that's what you gotta it's pinch not, it. It's not fun. Not fun trick. Doing a how-to on a trick that I'm not even very good at. No, switch bars you're really good at. Straight. Yeah. Or if I have something to jump out of, they're easy. But flat ground. Not that's what's scary about how your bike. You need a pinch because they'll flop. Yeah. If you don't. I didn't squeeze, and I threw it, and it just fell. So at least you got the the picture of how what could happen. Yeah. On a 180 bar, switch 180 bar. You can die on flat ground. Like any more? Do you need to learn anything else? Mm, just the squeeze. The main part is the squeeze. If you squeeze your apparatus, you're gonna be good. Yeah. Whatever you got. If you got a low seat, I don't know. If my seat was low, I don't know if I could do it because it like falls over. So I like to have a little bit of seat post to keep it keep it there. There's UPS, free coasters coming. I'll try Vicky switch bar. Yo. Yeah. That's why I need a free coaster. Is it easier with a free coaster? Yeah. I don't think I've ever done this on flat ground. See, this is good because they're learning with you. I'm, yeah, see, I'm learning as they're learning. Yeah, you're learning as they're learning, so this is perfect. That could happen. Just don't suck. Like, that. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys know Adam McCarty, he definitely does not suck, so don't listen to that. Yeah, I can't even do this. You got it. They're learning. It's a learning process. We're all learning. I can do them straight, all day in a straight line. <sighs> Bunny hop, but that's... Dude. I don't think I'm gonna do it. No? Yeah? I really don't think so. All right, we'll learn that for another how-to. Yeah, that would be, this, uh, once I learn what it. What about this set? You think you switch bar this set? Yeah. Let's switch bar, didn't it? Explain when did you learn it pretty good. I'm, hopefully I don't hit fucking the G-Ride right here. Damn, he took the, the sign out of the window. Damn. He had the Watts Car Club sign, but it's gone now. All right, so. I could go like really slow and try it. But yeah, a little bit of time makes it easier as well. You get to think about it. It's just a harder landing to flat, but we'll see what's gonna happen. Yeah. Try it. Yes. Take it some, that's a pretty big step to switch bar. I do like X Factor fucking but I love them. It works. Beautiful switch bar. Land them, and you got a swell bow. Jeez. That thing, dude. God. That was from yesterday. It hurts. Well, is that it? I don't know. Do we need more? I don't know. We might. I don't know. We always we need more. We always, we always need more for the viewers. We're always thinking about you guys. So, I mean, that's a how-to to switch bar spin with Adam McCarty. Make sure to go follow him at Adam McCarty on Instagram right here. Go follow him. Make sure. Get him to 20K. And speaking of 20k, we're about to hit 20k on YouTube, so thank you guys, and I'll be doing a giveaway tomorrow. And this is the end of the how-to. I wrapped it up over here at Adams, and we're all hanging out over here. 
playing Kadamas. We got stuck playing Kadamas for literally an hour. The game was so fun. I didn't film any of it, of course, because I missed it. But right now, I think I'm going to go home and edit this video for you guys. I mean, there's not much to do. And like I said, again, I'm sick. And yeah, I told you guys, I don't know if you guys read the comment in the last video that I that I had on uh, The Secrets Out. But um, why I dyed my hair blonde is for a reason I thought I could explain to you guys, but I couldn't. I posted the video and I had to edit out the part where I talked about the stuff on why I had to dye my hair and all that stuff. So, sorry about that guys to let you guys down. I just misunderstood what I can talk about and all that stuff, so sorry to whoever and everybody. But if you go to my Instagram, there's a cool clip of me doing a manual, so go peep that and you guys can figure it out yourself. And... Take whatever idea you guys want to take from that. For the rest of the week, I have no idea. I hope I get better. I still can't breathe. I hate being sick. It's the worst thing ever. <sighs> Especially since it's spring, so my allergies are bad. But everybody, make sure to always leave a comment, like, and subscribe to this channel. We're at 20K right now, I believe. I think we should be hitting 20K today, so tomorrow I'm probably going to be doing a giveaway. I'm going to send a bunch of Stranger Stickers out, so leave a comment in this video. I think I have like 10 to 12 Stranger Sticker Packs. So leave a comment and I'll probably pick you and hit me up. And there might be another surprise in the next video. Who knows? Stay tuned. Watch until next time. Later, guys. Bye.